Good afternoon. Thank you again for this opportunity to speak today. Um, I'm here to appeal to you to listen to local elected officials and other concerned speakers that are here today. This compact as written is not feasible or respectful to local jurisdic excuse me, jurisdictions. It does nothing to help solve our traffic and transportation issues. It will seriously interfere with our ability to fund infrastructure and services. It will have the opposite effect of its desired, opposite of its desired effect. It will make housing more expensive by effectively upzoning significant areas. Last night, the Los Altos City Council voted unanimously and will be sending a letter to MTC, ABAG, and other elected officials and cities association opposing this compact as written. Elected officials have asked, do not approve this compact in this form. Go back, engage with us, create something that is truly feasible without massive adverse effects on our ability to govern and provide services to our constituents. We oppose top-down, behind closed doors planning. By moving forward, you are asking everyday citizens to take the brunt of this plan through increased housing costs, harming infrastructure, and decimating city services like schools, water, and public safety. We are concerned that this money will be managed and dispersed by an independent body that is not subject to citizen oversight. Please be aware, the increase in taxes will hit cities, PERS contributions, cities as PERS contributions go up, and this will significantly impact the services we provide our residents. This compact will make it difficult for local officials to do our job and serve our residents. Thank you.